Hello everyone, my name is Holden Hardman and this is my wonderful fiance, Jennifer. Hello. Right now we are kind of in a groove. We're watching and reacting to some shorter form content. Neither of us have seen the Eternals final trailer. It came out about a week ago now, so we're a little behind, mm -hmm. but we've gotten enough comments asking for it. So we're gonna go ahead and watch it. Here's the little I know about the Eternals just from the comic perspective. When this movie was announced, I had no idea who the Eternals were. Kind of like when Guardians of the Galaxy first came out, I had no idea who any of those characters were. I ended up loving them, so I really wanted to learn about them. So I read one of Neil Gaiman's graphic novels on the Eternals, and now I have some familiarity with the universe. So I'm really looking forward to watching it and hopefully being able to pick some stuff out like I'm an insider in the comics. You know anything about the Eternals? Any interest or anything so far? I don't know anything about the Eternals. I saw a preview when we saw, I, I want to say it was old, the movie yeah. Old. Yeah, they had a trailer in the movie theater. Yeah, it was very, very brief. And I was almost a little confused. Like, I didn't understand what it was about. Mm -hmm. I don't know what to think. Yeah. I know that it has Angelina Jolie. I don't think that I noticed anybody else. Couple, Maybe one or two, two other Game people. Thrones. But it did, it looked interesting. I didn't say, it, I didn't mean it looked bad. I just really didn't understand what it was about. Yeah, let's go ahead and just watch the final trailer. Five years ago, Thanos erased half of the population of okay. the universe. Okay, so they're mentioning Thanos. The people of this planet brought everyone back with a snap of a finger. A sudden return of the population provided the necessary energy for the emergence to begin. Oh. Seven days. We're Eternals. We came here 7,000 years ago to protect humans from the deviants. Look at that. Why didn't you guys help fight Thanos? Or any war, or all the other terrible things throughout history? That's the big question. Where were they? Did not to interfere in any human conflicts unless deviants are involved. By who? So they can't get involved? Um, yeah, unless there are deviants involved. What? We need to find the others. We'll see. I haven't seen some of them for centuries. Hi. Hello. This is what the end of the world looks like. Be sprite. At least we have front row seats. You know what's never saved the planet? Your sarcasm. Oh, wow. We have loved these people since the day we arrived. When you love something, you protect it. You know nothing. Jumps now. You can't protect. Any of them. Oh, nice. Perfect safe house. What's this even? Vibranium. <laughs> I don't know. I'm really excited to see it, but I'm still confused as to. I, I get that there's some kind of entity that is trying to kill off humanity. But I guess I'm just like, I still don't understand who the Eternals are. Yeah. I don't know if that's something that they just are intentionally trying to keep hidden. Uh -huh. It still looked really, really good. It seems like there's a lot of good action. It seems like there's a lot of good characters, even though there's also a bunch of new faces to me I don't recognize. Yeah. Of course, Angelina Jolie, I know the guy from, um, that plays Jon Snow. His um, brother is in this too, is the, is, I think it's Icarus, is the one that's shooting lasers out of his eyes. Okay, and then of course, Salma Hayek is in it. As far as everybody else, I've never seen them before. In the comics that I read, and I guess the way that they're intertwining it with where we're at in the MCU, 
The Eternals are very, very powerful uh, beings created by the Celestials. Remember Ego being a Celestial? They're kind of like gods, pretty okay. much. So Ego is a Celestial, but there are others. So in the trailer, when she's like, where did we come from? And he looked up and there's that big creature. Mm -hmm. I'm guessing that that's a Celestial, like a god type of thing. The big question uh, has been, where have they been this whole time? Where sure. were they with Thanos and the attack on New York and basically anything that's been going on because they're so powerful. I mean, you saw just how powerful he was and he's, you know, Well, in the trailer apart. though, they said they can't, um, intervene right yeah they just went ahead and addressed it in the trailer yeah. so the the celestials created the eternals and they they created these creatures called deviants it's the eternals job to keep the deviants in check to like fight them and i guess in the story of like the mcu i guess the snap that brought everyone back created some sort of power or some sort of trigger that unleashed the deviants on earth therefore the eternals are now getting involved it's what it seems to me really interesting i don't know uh, to what extent they'll incorporate with the new Avengers. We're starting to get much more powerful characters involved, so almost Superman-like abilities. So we're yeah. getting out of the Captain America, you know, super soldier serum That's level. That's gonna be my question. Like, I understand how they tackled the whole, okay, well, where were the Eternals during, like, Endgame? Mm -hmm. Where are the Avengers gonna be in this movie? Yeah, that's a good question. So, so they may not even be aware of the Eternals until the events, maybe. Yeah. Maybe Nick Fury will show up at the end of the movie and be like, yeah, I wanna join the Avengers. Also, the Eternals all have different powers and different strengths. I think in the comic there were 100 Eternals, 100. I don't know if they're if it's the same thing here, but, like, Icar I think that's Icarus, um, the one that shoots lasers, can fly. One of them had like super speed. One of them could like read minds. So they're kind of like the X-Men in that sense. I am really looking forward to it. I like yeah, that, that we have too. some familiarity a little bit before going in. The comic I read um, was really, really cool. I'll link it down below. I'm, I don't have an affiliate link. I don't get paid for or anything, but you can read the one that I read. This seems like it'll just be a classic battle of the Eternals versus the Deviants. But I'm sure that they'll do a very Marvel thing and, and make it more uh, fulfilling in the, well. Juicy. Yeah, make it more juicy with the rest of the continuity of the MCU. Any final thoughts? No. Nope. If you enjoyed this video, leave it a like. Helps the channel out a lot. Comment down below letting us know what you think of the Eternals, the final trailer. We'll definitely be checking it out. Hopefully it'll come out on Disney Plus so we can react yeah. to it. Consider joining me on Patreon to get early access to select videos. Consider subscribing for more fun content like this. As always, we appreciate you watching. We'll catch you in the next video. Hi. Take care.